Hello and welcome to episode 14 of our Timberborn update for Water Beaver mod playthrough here in cycle 21, day 13. Last time, expanded a whole bunch of farming up here, and we started getting into this area to turn this into some usable land. Got lots of blueberries over here we can be harvesting, and plenty of other fun stuff to get to. But there's a lot of other stuff we want to do as well. And we're going to go ahead and jump right on in. So let's hit that unpause button and check and see what's going on. I don't know why the clay pit doesn't have a recipe assigned to it. Oh, it's because it got an upgrade. Uh, last update, I think you could pan for gold, but I don't think we're going to do any of that quite yet. We'll just set this back to clay and see what else is going on. Food wise, we have says 2700 food. Uh, but most of that seems to be pumpkins, pumpkins and kimchi. Although we don't have, as far as I can tell in our main district, we don't have a larger tank dedicated to kimchi storage. It's basically just the small one. And then we have all these fermentation barrels. But over here, we do in fact have 300 kimchi storage assigned to this area. So I think what we're going to want to do is find somewhere to put either a giant buried tank full of kimchi or something to that effect. But the way this is set up, I'm not exactly sure that's going to be uh, going to be very possible. We'll see what happens. I kind of also want to put another one of these medium mines in place, but because of the way the geometry is working for this, might not be in our favor. If we were to... Uh... Actually, I don't even remember where these... Uh... Okay, there it is. This guy right here. I'm going to take this out of uh, that mode so we can see everything. So I could, I could in theory, do one of these kind of things, but I would have to blast out a whole lot of land. Could do something like this, but uh, the way this is set up, I don't think that's really going to uh, make a whole lot of sense. I don't know. Probably shouldn't have put the first one right here, but uh, that's what we got. That's what we did, so that is uh, what we're kind of stuck with. I would like for them to be mostly in the same area, so maybe we do end up, maybe we do end up doing something, something like this. We'd have to have a, a pretty, uh, pretty good reason to be doing all this. I think, I think, so that was always my first mistake, right? Is thinking probably are going to want to be uh, putting it right about here anyway. We can blast some other stuff out of the way. So if that's going to be the case, I, I can't put any uh, markers down or anything, but I think these uh, central six squares we could probably start out with. Let's see what happens uh, when we get into that, because that's going to be the border. So then I think these, I think these six are the ones we want. And we also are going to want to get rid of all of those. I think they can reach all this. I was wrong. I, they cannot. So we'll give them a little bit of help here. There we go. So that's a whole thing. Because the reason I want to do that is because uh, there is no 50-50 recipe. So you're going to have either more iron or more coal. And I would kind of like to have that balanced out. Plus we can also get... Wait, you can mine water? Huh. Well, I guess that makes sense. Being something that you could possibly do. But what we need to be doing is we need to be improving our mining area so that we can have larger storage of things like mountain salt and coal and everything in different places here. We also have the option in our storage piles here. I have science to actually research this right now, the large industrial piles. We could start stacking things. Iron teeth style could be some good fun. But that's going to take them a little while to do that. So let's talk a little bit about what's going to be going on here. Uh, a lot of you said in the comments that you would like to see this filled, and I agree. I think that would be all sorts of fun. But the method behind how we're going to do it is uh, what's currently up for debate. I kind of want to just cut a channel here so it's always full. But, but the water cannon is very, very intriguing. <laughs> now, I'm not exactly sure what this... Uh, what this blue sparkly blueprint is. So I wonder if that's something I can take a look at. See, I don't, I, I don't just, it might be something you have to get in the ENS. Not sure, but um, yeah. Easy way, 
around this is to just, you know, go ahead and cut a trench, which I think is probably the smart thing to do. And then, of course, we have our blueberries here we can be harvesting to have a nice big stock of those. These guys right here, hard at work, lumberjacking. So since we're already over here, let's just decide on a, uh, a route for our water here. It doesn't necessarily have to be... Uh, doesn't necessarily have to be anything crazy. But I would like it to make at least a little bit of sense. So we'll have to wait, of course, for them to cut out some of the rest of these trees. But never hurts to have stuff already ready to go. Okay, they haven't put that one in yet. But we do need to go ahead and get this blasted all the way down. Should not have any, uh, any issues with that. And of course, the reason this has to go away is so the path can go through here. And then we'll probably end up reworking where all these piles are. I'll move some of this stuff around because we do have four of these primitive ironworks making different things. We have two of them making crude, crude saw blades, one making tools, one making metal fasteners because there are only three different recipes now that we can do with them because uh, one of the recipes was removed in the most recent update. And we only have a couple days left of our temperate weather cycle. And I currently have them making an anvil. I probably shouldn't have them make anvils anymore. Probably should be stuff that we can actually use, like metal blocks, perhaps. Seems like that would be a more wise choice. Maybe, just a little bit. Thankfully, though, the uh, farming seems to be going extremely well. We have plenty of pumpkins growing here. Sunflower seeds slowly ticking up as well. And that's something that is going to be uh, very important moving forward because we've got a lot of other stuff we want to get to, too. In fact, uh, I've heard people in the comments mention spicy soda specifically as being something we want to look into making. And I believe that's this thing in the cooking house, second from the bottom. Looks like, uh, yeah, that's just the bramble flowers and water. Feels like that would be good spicy soda. But we haven't researched this yet. We need a medium cauldron, which we have two of. And I don't think this requires power, so let's go ahead and research this. Cooking house. Cool, just a regular old house. So, uh, oh, there's our drought warning. So where do we want to put this bad boy? We can put him in somewhere. If it's bramble flowers, probably is going to need to be near brambles. But hey, guess what we've got down here? we got a lot of brambles. A lot of bramble flowers, so we could actually make spicy soda here and import it into the other districts. I kind of like that idea. So I'm going to have to turn this back on so I can actually see what I'm doing. Cooking house right here. If we did something like this, put that guy right there. Set the recipe to spicy soda. Very, very easy thing for us to go ahead and make. And the bramble flowers, I think, have to go in a regular... Uh, Regular warehouse? Do I have storage of those in here? Yes, I do. Medium warehouse of bramble flowers. Uh, we could set that one to supply. And then... Um, oh yeah, I'm, I'm going to have room. Can make a large warehouse just for bramble flowers. I just have to decide if that's where I want to put that. I don't think it's really going to matter that much. They've already started building that, so I guess I'll just leave that alone. We have a large warehouse for the bramble flowers. Uh, let's remember what these things are. I almost said what they're called, but this is a picture, not words. Uh, we'll set that to obtain. And then we're going to need to have a pretty large tank. Dare I say a giant buried tank for our bramble flowers. I always want to click on that. This guy, um, again, we're going to have to detonate some stuff. This has to be uh, on solid ground. I don't know if it's going to let me do this, actually. But if I were to do this, probably wouldn't be the best place for that. I don't know. This thing kicked my butt so hard the last time I tried to build one of these. But it really just does need to be a 3x3 three three pit two stories deep. But it has to have space around the side. Which would make me think that the way that this uh, is currently set up is not going to let me put anything in there. So, what I'll do instead is I'll just put this right next door 
and we'll put the large storage across the way here. So I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to have to do this the, uh, the fun way. It's going to take me a little bit of time. Uh, do I have dynamite storage in this district? I actually don't remember. I do not know. Well, I guess I could just click on this. Yes, I do. I have three. Three explosive storage. So that's uh, that's fine. We're not in a hurry. We've got plenty more to accomplish. Please do not crash. Thank you. Okay, now I can blow this up. Making good progress there. Did they place these? They sure did. Uh, I'm going to speed up our harvesting of trees in the specific direction we're trying to go by uh, unmarking everything except the ones that are in the way of this little uh, little channel I'm going to be making. Because it would be really, really nice if uh, this could get filled up before the drought happens. So that's why I'm attempting to make them go a little bit faster. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and blow this up. Please do not walk into it. Thank you. Almost had uh, Idiot Beaver's Darwin Award themselves out of existence. But uh, having that already blasted is going to make it that much easier for us to get everything taken care of. Meanwhile, over here, they're still placing the explosives, uh, well, in place <laughs> where they're supposed to be going, so that's fine. Now, our spicy soda factory cooking house thing uh, should be able to get all of these materials. Uh, the medium cauldron, we might have to... Yeah, we might have to make a uh, glorious storage just for those guys right here. Yep, and then uh, clay does not have a storage at all, does it? I don't think it does, so if we do just a little pile. Uh, for right now, since that's where that needs to be, we'll just... Uh, that's That's dirt. Does clay not go in a pile? I feel like clay should go in a pile. But instead, instead, it's probably something that goes in a warehouse, which doesn't make any sense to me. But that's fine. Where's my clay? There it is. I just set that guy right there. Now watch me already have storage for this. I have three clay stored. So now, now I'm curious. Are they going to import any more of the... Uh, any more of the... My God, this is complicated. Um, I don't even know what half this stuff is. Sheesh. Okay, it's been a long time since I've looked at this. Dynamite. Where in the world? There it is. Set to always import. Okay, so that's fine. Uh, I wonder if I can figure out which one of these sparkly blue things was the one that was in that uh, that one building. Mechanical water pump fancy blueprints. Small aquifer pump, mechanical drill, clockwork hydroponic farm, ENS, fancy mechanical blueprints. Well, consider me thoroughly confused. We're going to go somewhere else. <laughs> oh, we got enough going on over here. All right, those bits are done. I think this is a, a 4D pole. Yes, it is. Okay, so we'll do that twice more. And then we'll blast around in the way that we're supposed to be blasting. Yeah, so again, the reason this is getting built like this, well, now I can't actually put this where it needs to go, except for this one uh, one little overhead shot. There we go. That's why that is the way it is. I think. Unless I've just done this incredibly wrong. Oh, uh, no, it is it is a 3x3 three three space we have to, uh, have to blast out. But that's why I hadn't done it yet, because that was... Uh, set up a little bit differently. How are we doing here? Got enough space to put in some more dinamite. Oh, I can go almost all the way out. Okay, well, let's do that then. Then at the very end, I think I'll have this open up a little bit once they get that uh, little bit of wood out of here. And I think, I think this little bit right here should be... Uh, should be okay if I have it set up like that. Yeah, but we definitely need to make sure this gets taken care of. And we're still on single time speed, so we can speed that up 
make sure we can take care of everything we've got to take care of. All right, meanwhile, back over here at the ranch, we don't have any more explosives set up, do we? So those are going to have to have, and yeah, those are going to have to have some, uh, some storage for themselves as well. The reason I'm putting it over here is because that is the shortest route from our uh, district crossing for them to bring stuff in. Yep, going to take us a little bit of time to get through this. But we will, in fact, get through this. We just have to wait. I'm not expecting the, uh, the spicy sodas to be up and running until well into the drought. But what I am expecting to be up and running is this little canal here. So we got to get these guys going. Give them whatever they need to have to succeed. Why are we sitting on ourselves here? Because we don't have storage for logs. Is that what this is about? All right. Um, I, I didn't think we were that full on them. When in fact we are basically full. So let's pause real quick. I'm going to have to have... And I'm going to have to have some additional storage. These are planks, scrap metal, logs, metal blocks, logs, planks, sawdust pile. Uh, this, mm, I don't have anywhere else to put stuff, so I guess I do have to actually uh, have this somewhere. This is set to supply, prioritized by haulers. I guess I will go ahead, since we are already here, I'll just change this into log storage. And make that a priority so we can get these things moved in here. These guys got to get to work. Got to get these things moved out so they can get more wood cut down. And there we go. Haulers should, should, being the operative term, take care of that. Our tree cutters should also be able to come up here and, well, cut their trees. That is the entire reason that we're here. Get this dynamite put into place and start having this whole thing... Well, blast it out, I guess, is the best way to say it. Got plenty of stuff to take care of here. And we'll see what ends up happening. But I think right now we're still on track to get this finished. Just have to actually get all of the dynamite laid. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to high prioritize all of that. But now I'm concerned... That we don't have any dynamite, so am I going to have to... Okay, so we have... Ah, uh, we don't have nitroglycerin. Okay, here we go. We're making nitroglycerin. But we don't have sunflower oil. My god, man. This is the most punishing mod imaginable. Okay, sunflower oil. You're taking your sweet time to make sunflower oil. Berry juice, I no longer care. We are making sunflower oil. Oh, man, this is stressful. All right, we got Noodles and Keaton Edwards. Get in here and make your sunflower oil, I swear. <laughs> you are required by international beaver law to report to work and <laughs> make some sunflower oil. Oh, we really, we really need it. At least we have sunflower seeds, I can tell you that for sure. But now, <laughs> I don't have a, I don't have sunflower seeds here. All right, um, mm, 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 I went the wrong way. So here's what we're going to do is I'm going to remove the dynamite and they can come get it and take it over there because that's much more important than blasting out for a second mine. We have to get this done. Absolutely must have this starting to fill this with water. So get over here with your explosives. Okay, I, I see him carrying explosives now. Get over here and put those things in there. Let's go. I know you can do it. All right, sunflower oil is being produced. Sunflower oil is being produced. Now we just have to take it all, all the way over here. Oh, man, all the way over here to make uh, nitroglycerin. And then the Handicrafter's Lodge just needs a little bit more to make some more dynamite. Man, that is... Mm, we're, we are we're sweating right now. No, don't bring it over here. Oh, no. I hope they're not bringing that stuff in here. I, I mean, I need this, but not right now. Oh, we're going to cut this so close, and I'm going to be so upset when it doesn't work. All right. 
Oh, I just need one more of these. I need... Oh, they're too far away. You're kidding. You are joking. Guess what, kids? Party's over. 24-hour work hours right now. All right. I can... Uh, I can widen this later. I just need this to actually... Uh, actually be a channel that will operate. So I'll make that one the... Uh, later one because I know I can do that later I just need I just need this one to be the very first very next one that they actually put into place and I know I know they can do it they just need to get the one come on man the one one a single bit of explosives are we are we actually even making anything right now nitroglycerin 19%, 19% explosives, 0%. My guy, let's, let's go, dude. Oh, all right. 10 hours, 10 hours, 10 hours. You are absolutely non-family friendly -ing me right now. Come on, come on, man. <sighs> One of these absolutely just destroying me. Okay. I'm going to remove these two so they can come grab it. <laughs> oh, and put it in this one one spot to open this up. Come on. Come on. This water is going to be all gone. I'm going to get mad. Let's go. Come on. It's a race against time. No, 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 you better not. You better not take that away. You come back here. You come back here and you put this right here. You're going to walk all the way. Where, where is the... Oh, jeez. Beavers are stupid, is what this is. They got to walk all the way back there, just so someone can... I swear to God. All right. I'm going to have to diagnose these beavers with terminal stupidity. That's That's exactly what this is. All right, drought started. We missed it by one. One tile. One singular little bit of lousy dynamite. Well, I hope they enjoyed putting this in this small warehouse because they have completely ruined the next 45 minutes of this video. Yeah, you better, you better come get this thing. One tile. A single one absolutely just destroyed me. All right. Where are my builders? All right. Carrying nothing. Thanks for being worthless. Carrying nothing. Thanks for being worthless. You're carrying explosives. Are you? Oh, he's not going to make it. He's not going to make it. Absolutely not going to make it. This is... All. <laughs> oh, come on. You, you gotta run faster, my dude. It's gonna dry up the second he gets here. Yep. Absolutely incredible. Amazing. Incomprehensible amounts of incompetence on display right here. Thank you for doing your job so slowly that I could not do anything else. Well, now we've got a really dry trench and I'm actually irritated because I, <laughs> I can't put water in here. Because somebody forced the water dump to go inside of Alito. You're a sadist. That's what you are. Absolutely a sadist. So now we get to build one of these. Just so I can dump some water in a hole. Well. It's befitting this playthrough of suffering that this is what happens when I try to do something interesting. So we're going to go right back to what we were doing before and uh, ignore that for a very long period of time. Hey, we have spicy sodas at least. <laughs> After all that. Oh, and I can't make any more sunflower oil, so I can't even make any more explosives in the first place because this isn't going to turn until the end of this drought. Okay. If only we had power. Do I dare do it? Do I dare do it? 
Do I dare put this back in and sacrifice beavers? The answer is no. But it's very tempting. All right. Five HP from the power wheel. Do I do that? Well, hold on. Hold on. Is this new solar array? I feel like it is. What, what does this say about solar arrays? It says nothing. Nothing about solar arrays. Okay. Well. Well, now you've got me, uh, now you got me curious here. Captures sunlight, turns into this weird quote-unquote electricity thing. Okay, well, that's going to require glass, which we can't make anyway. All right, just kick me while I'm down. Um, <laughs> crappy windmills. Oh, jeez, what a pain. All right, um, I can put one here, but then I can't get the power attached to anything because I have to build some sort of unholy snake mechanism here. Oh, jeez, what am I supposed to do with this? Uh, hmm. This is the only three tall building I have over here. These aren't three tall. <sighs> is that is that going to work if I put it on top of something that's like artificially three tall? Can I actually, I can't, I know I can't stack these things. But th see, there's no way, it, there's no way it would let me get away with this, right? Right? Are you joking? <laughs> um, you, you're telling me I could have done this the whole time. Oh man, I don't. I don't even think I can. I don't think I can build that there. I'm gonna have to move it down to a. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no, oh no, they they made the mistake of allowing me to do this. Now, the question is going to become, how do I get the power down? That is already, already higher. If I have, I'm going to have to have this set on top of, how many of these scaffoldings do I have? 176, okay. This is incredibly stupid, and you should never, you should never ever do this. There are better ways. <laughs> there, there are better ways to accomplish uh, what I'm attempting to do here. But, uh. <laughs> Alright, so here's, here's what we're going to do. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to swap this with a power shaft intersection. Oh, we're going to have, uh, oh, I, I can't, I can't build this until that's put in. Um, going to have this put in, then that can go here. Then, uh, put the platform here and here. And then this goes here. That go. this is so ugly, I swear. <laughs> oh, they're not going to be able to, they're not going to be able to reach this anyway. So I'm, I'm going to have to, uh. <laughs> I can't I can't believe this. I can't believe this. <laughs> well hey, if it's stupid but it works, guess what? It's not stupid. I just I can't I can't, I can't stop laughing at this man. Alright, I can uh, I can put this in. There we go. Because I, I, I have to be able to make stuff. I cannot wait eight straight days without making things. This is just absolutely just incredibly frustrating. Okay. Well, now that channel's there, at least. And that's there. Oh, man. Hey, there's there's water here. Woohoo. Woohoo. We got water. Man, I, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what, man. This, I mean, this is going to be useless once this is flooded anyway, but. <laughs> oh, I, I should not be allowed to be doing this. Okay, do we have, I got 11 of these things. All right. Um, yeah, we, we got to. <laughs> oh, we, we got, we got to, we got to do this the right way. All right. 
medium mind. I, I don't know why I'm lacking the confidence to believe that I've done this correctly. But that's not going to work. This has to go... Oh, I can also just move that. Probably would help. Maybe. I don't know. It's so hard to get this thing to display in the right spot. Well, that's what it's gonna. That's what it's gonna look like. I just have to get the. Uh, just have to get these other uh, other spots put in. Man, what? <laughs> oh, what a bunch of what a bunch of stupid nonsense this is. All right, so what are we waiting on here? <laughs> are you kidding me? God laughs at my misfortune. Sunflower oil, zero out of five. Are you? <laughs> You're absolutely, absolutely joking. The thing that I was trying to build to solve the problem of not having sunflower oil itself requires sun. This is the epitome of this mod. This is. <sighs> All right, kiddos. It's time to go do literally anything else. Because I've got to build a power wheel. Oh, come on. I am beside myself with rage. Oh, oh, of course. It requires sunflower oil to build the... This is upsetting. <laughs> I can't win. I literally can't win. <laughs> I can't. I can't win. There's no way. There's no way to generate power without sunflower oil, and I can't make it without power. This. This is. This is divine punishment. Is what this is. I. I only have. I only have one. One option left. We. We got it. We got to have the power billboard. We got to do it, man. Oh no, we got oh, we we're, we're just going to kill all the beavers. We're going to kill the beavers with power. That's what we're doing. Cuz I have to I have to have I got to have sunflower oil. I I just, I mm. I oh man, I I got nothing. I got nothing. This this is this is a test and I have failed. All right. So we're gonna we're gonna sacrifice beavers to the grues so we can make some stinking sunflower oil. Oh my god, man! Yep, gotta gotta pause every other building so we can make sunflower oil. <sighs> now they're gonna empty all the supplies, and then we're gonna have to put them back in. But <laughs> I just. Oh, eaten by hungry monsters. I'm so sorry. Ford Prefect, Ace, Mike O'Donnell. Weak heck, Bam905. Your sacrifice shall not be made in vain. Yes, we're still on the 24-hour cycle because I'm punishing these stupid idiot beavers. I just, I need the sunflower oil. I need, I need them to build the windmill and then I can get rid of the awful billboard. Just, just, just bring the sunflower oil here. Just, just, just put it, just put it in here. And nobody else has to die. Two more. Two more units of sunflower oil. That's all I need. That's all I need. <laughs> oh, we've lost so many. We've lost so many beavers. <laughs> all right. Give me one more. One more. Why did you stop? Why did you stop at 71%? Okay. There you go. All right. It's gone. <laughs> we 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 we've lost so many beavers. How how many did how many did we lose? 1 2 3 oh, 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 We lost 17 17 beavers to build this one miserable, crappy windmill that isn't even connected 
because <laughs> I can't connect it yet. Oh, man. I really hope you guys like seeing me suffer because that's... Why did that go on top of that? That doesn't make any sense. All right, whatever. I, I'm, I'm beyond it at this point. <laughs> this is a load of crap. That's what this is. All right. There we go. There we go. At least these don't require sunflower. What kind of sadist requires sunflower oil to make stuff that produces sunflower oil? My god, man, you've broken me again. All right. <laughs> well, at least I've got this trench that I've dug with the help of my friends. That's... that's that's all I got, man. It's all I have to say for everything to do with this is at least I have this trench. And all these beavers died so we could have this trench. So be grateful when we have more of this stuff coming out of the mine. All the beavers died to give us this stuff. All right. Four explosives. Now we got to do this whole thing again, and then we'll uh, look at these front two, and then I've got to build the thing, which means I'm gonna have to bring in materials. But man, <laughs> spicy soda! All that for a drop of spicy soda. Hope that stuff tastes good. It should taste like shame. We have clay though. Let's. Uh, that's fun, I guess. Oh, these poor beavers, man. These poor beavers. Do they do they know the crimes that they're they're committing for their recreational purposes? Look at that. Look at that. We got two HP. We got two HP going into this group reses so we could make Oh man, so we can make sunflower oil so we can do other stuff. I I swear. It's gonna be the death of me, man. Oh jeez, what a what a load of you-know-what. But hey, I got a crappy windmill. <laughs> but no 5 HP. As advertised, a third of the power capacity. Uh, well, we also have this going for us, which is nice. Oh, and I can't even get to the other side of the river because I blew it up. Yep, yep, sounds about right. <sighs> now we gotta be able to get to the other side of this. So I, I guess what I will do, I don't really need this to be three, but I've got so many of these things, I don't care. We'll just go straight here. Hey, look, there's two and a half days left. I could have just waited, but instead I had to plunge my colony into utter chaos to build a windmill. All right. Our things going over here. Oh, now we're out of now we're out of dynamite. Yep, yep. This this truly is the paragon of suffering for our beavers here. Well, at least we got full storage of kimchi. That's about uh, that's about all we can say about that. Meanwhile, at the library, the nerds have been hard at work at getting us science for me to just completely ignore it and chase rabbits over here with windmills for 20 minutes. Oh, man. I, see, I don't even know what I was going to unlock next. See, we already did the kitchen house, which uh, is working over there. And we do have brambles over here, I think, in this district. We should be... Uh, yeah, so let's um, let's build ourselves a cooking house, shall we? Just find ourselves a nice place over here where it will uh, where it will fit. I guess right here probably would work. Whoa, hold on. Look at the uh, look at the shower animation here. <laughs> I love it. Yep. So this is gonna be making uh, gonna be making some spicy soda for us. 
can't have materials for explosives. Now, what is it that we're missing for explosives? Is it nitroglycerin? Most likely. Yep, that's exactly what it is. Well, we have a windmill. Oh, it's making 14 HP now. Wow, look at, look at, look at, look at him go. Look at him go. <laughs> this game is going to break me even more than it already has. So, like I said when we started this complete absolute disaster of an episode. Oh, we do have kimchi storage over here. Um, we need to have some more storage for other types of beverages like the spicy sodas and uh, associated things. But I'm not entirely sure how we're supposed to uh, find places to put things because I didn't really, uh, didn't really do that good of a job laying this whole thing out, unfortunately. So I've got to, I've got to find a place to put a giant storage for spicy soda. Or maybe I don't. Maybe I just don't need to worry about it. Maybe that can be my uh, my self-care for the day. It's just ignoring my problems. All right, farmhouse. Probably does not need to be here. I put this here to harvest stuff, so we're going to get rid of that. And I should, I really should unpause the rest of these because there's, you know, beavers living in here. But um, also need to be making sunflower oil once again. Well, all that means is the beavers did not um, repopulate when I killed all of them with the power billboard. Okay. Um, so I just don't have anywhere good to put this stuff. But the kitchen house is is operating and making spicy soda, so that's good to see. That's one win. One win we got out of today. All right, I'm going to go ahead and unpause all of these. Because we're, we're going to need the... Uh, going to need the beavers to come back to work. And uh, hopefully not ever have to be sacrificed to build a crappy windmill ever again. But hey, let's... Uh, <laughs> That's the way this stuff goes, man. At least we have chestnuts. Now, still don't have, still don't have dynamite over here. Man. <sighs> I'm just, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm just gonna, just gonna build this here. We're, we're just, we're just, we're just gonna build this. It's fine. Don't don't ever look up how we were able. <laughs> don't ever look up how we were able to make spicy soda. It's a it's a terrible chapter of our our beavers history here. But hey, there's water here. Finally, after eight thousand years. <sighs> All right. Well, I don't I don't need to uh to blast this out yet. I do need to blast the rest of this out, but uh. We're gonna be uh, we're gonna be in trouble here in a second, so I, I guess I could just wait on that. We gotta gotta get a couple more levels of that done. Otherwise, though, food's looking good. Food's looking really good. Don't really have anything to complain about there. We probably should have more storage for tar, but again, I have not laid this out very well, and I'm kind of reluctant to build a bunch of stuff in here because I feel like I'm gonna have to have this be mostly uh, different types of crafting. But I suppose I could go off of the side with these pit tanks. Have one of these for tar. And uh, one of them for maybe some spicy soda. Yeah, so let's um, let's just do uh, just do a little bit of that. Doesn't take up any more space up here except for the uh, the path we're going to have to put in anyway. That gives us someplace else to put the tar that we're, I'm sure, going to have to make again at some point. But now we have the ability to actually generate power again as soon as the water comes back, which it will in just a moment here. What a disaster of an episode this has been. <laughs> Un unmitigated suffering is what this is. All right. But hey, we're making spicy soda. 
<laughs> that I decided that was uh, one of my main goals for today was to start making spicy soda because you guys said it was important. So that's what we did. The ENS requires spicy soda to make science. So at least we have that. I also see looks like uh, coffee and some sort of a pie. The pumpkin chips we already knew about and then uh, green peas in some sort of noodle bowl. But yeah, that's, uh, yep, all that for a drop of spicy soda. I don't even know if it gets used in anything else. But we got it. We got it. We made it. Okay, the gristmill makes noodles out of spatter dock. That's probably also something we should be doing. Because we have all that spatter dock from before. It takes chestnuts and it requires gears. But it also uses power. Our favorite, our favorite thing ever. Okay, is this another one of the entrance on the second floor? No, thank God. Okay. Where can I... Oh, t the power goes in on the second floor. Okay, so that's going to go... I guess that can go here. So let's remove these resources in front of it for... I think, yeah, it's going to require all those spots. But we have plenty of berries over here, so we don't we don't need to worry about these being, uh, being removed. All right, in we go. Thankfully... For this one, all we have to do is put in one of these. And then that's going to be make <laughs> weird, <laughs> weird udon. Of course, that's what that would be called. Okay. I have gears. I don't have planks. No, I do. They're just over here in this other, uh, other thing. I don't know why they're not in the same spot. Okay, man, this is a, uh, this has sure been a weird, weird episode. People seem to like it when I, I suffer, so I guess it's good for the brand, even if it is uh, stressful. <laughs> Building needs power to upreak. Need to well, we're making, uh, we're making power. I need, to, I need to put gravity batteries in. I need to, but I don't have anywhere to hang them off of. That's been the whole problem in this game is you can't, uh, this mod pack, you can't just stack platforms infinitely high. You have to actually plan where these things are going to go. So for it to really, for it to really make sense, you, you gotta, you know, put a whole lot of thought into it, which I can respect. However, it's a huge pain in the butt. It's enormous, enormous pain in the butt. Because I'm only going to be able to, uh, in this exact spot, but, um, yeah, because I've got to, uh, oh, I can research the actual one. So why, why does this provide less power? Why is that two separate? Well, well, I have enough to unlock both, so we might as well just check it out. All right, so if I put that there, oh, it's not going to tell me. But I'm going to unlock this other one, too. Are these exactly the same model? No, they're not. This one has more logs. But I just... I I don't know why there's two separate gravity batteries. Is, is that to just not lock you behind having metal blocks? Because I don't have a lot of metal blocks? Huh. Well, I'll tell you what. Just because I don't have a ton of metal blocks, we'll build build a couple of these. Because now I've got to uh, I've got to get the power up there. Oh no, that's going to be such a pain. Um, I guess not. Probably if I just have this put in here like so. Should I probably have this attached to a building instead? Yeah, but I don't really know don't really know what the best strategy for that would be and I just kind of want to you know actually accomplish this in the next five ten minutes <laughs> so I'm not gonna worry about it I hope they can reach all of this stuff might pause that one just so they can actually get to the rest of it but 
Uh, this will give us a chance to hopefully at some point actually have some power stored, even if it's just a tiny bit, so we don't we don't ever have to sacrifice the beavers again. All right, what are you what are you crying about now? Nothing to do in range because I didn't uh, oh, I didn't finish cutting the trees down. Okay. All right, so I can uh, I can redo these as cuttable trees. And that's flooded. It's going to probably be flooded forever. Uh, this can now go away. All of that can go away. That was just a temporary stopgap, so that's fine. All right. Um, good. This is ready. All right. So we're we're getting closer to having the second mine in place. Let's check out over here in Spicy Soda Land. I just have to put this one here, and then we can start building our giant tank to store crazy amounts of spicy soda. A Bramble Dam original. At least in this incarnation of the world. All right. Large storage. Giant buried tank. Built it correctly the first time. Good. Uh, spicy soda. Now, I don't know if they're going to be able to get the giant buried tank fancy blueprint here without me building a storage for it, but we're going to we're going to find out. Yeah, the 50 metal blocks might take a while to build, but we definitely want to be able to store a bunch of spicy soda. Also, it gives me more of an excuse to uh, get better at doing the rest of it. My God, are these all hungry and thirsty? We're still in 24 hour days. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to get some really angry comments about that one. Oh, you guys are going to rip me apart, but that's fine. They, uh, they're they suffering for their art and their spicy sodas. Did somebody get stuck? You stupid beaver. Your namesake is going to be very upset with you. I'm sure they are an intelligent person who would never get stuck behind one of these things. So I'll get rid of it so you can escape and go somewhere else. Now get out of here. Go on, get, wake up, leave. <laughs> oh, man. They're killing me, man. There we go. All right, get your, uh, get your little bits out of here. No, you stupid. All right. All right. I, this game hates me. So now to actually build these things, I have to have additional platforms with some stairs. I guess I could have this go up this way. I think this one can build both of these. We'll see what happens. I hope they can build this one too. Oh. My my one my one hope and wish for today's video before I am finished is that I can actually have all of this in place operating somewhat smoothly and not want to uh not want to be uh shall we say miserable. It's probably the probably the best way to say it. All right, I, I want to at least get this connected. Oh man, it's already 53 minutes. This is what happens when you don't plan right, kids. But hey, we got water in here. Woohoo, we did it. All right, that's going in. Oh, and now this is turned around the opposite way, so I'm gonna, I'm sure I'm gonna put this in wrong. If someone said, hey, there's a billboard that tells you how to do this, like, yes, I guarantee you I could still look at that and do it wrong. But just to appease you, um, one of these has to be medium mind board. If we take a look at this, yes. Oh, I could have just built the stairs at the same time. Yeah, that, that would have been smart. It seems I have... I... I have figured out the most 
difficult possible way to accomplish this is what I've done. <laughs> oh man, and these oh, these trees gotta get out of here. Or maybe I can just build over them because they're seedlings. Yes, that's exactly what I will do. Man. I'll tell you what. <laughs> This is this has not been a, not been a great show of my uh, ability to not be completely stupid, but hey, we have a gravity battery. Woo, 9600. That's almost nothing. Yay. Um, I just want to know why there's two separate versions of this. So I don't have the I don't have the metal to build both. So I guess we'll find out. But. I wish it would tell me what the disadvantage to building the light gravity battery is. Like, is it going to generate less power? Because, eh. Potential energy is potential energy, so theoretically a higher mass would have higher stored energy. But I, I don't know, man. I, I need to see actual numbers to compare these two. Okay, let's... Uh, Let's just build the rest of this before I lose my mind the rest of the way. Because we also have the large water wheel that we can't research yet, but I've been attempting to. It probably is going to end up replacing all of these, but I wanted to make sure that I would have uh, plenty of extra power to store. Well, it's more important to have this connected, so I'm going to, uh, shall we say, deprioritize those. Yeah, build the rest of this, and then uh, this is waiting on metal fasteners that I... Do I really not have any more of those? That's um, that's a problem. Who's making my metal fasteners? Oh, we don't have any coal. Why is, why is that? Okay, this is mining saltpeter. Uh, I guess I'll just switch this one over to coal priority. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll we'll build this the correct way. I can, uh, I guess I don't really need this to be here. I, you know, I can respect putting help into billboards, but you you gotta understand that I just am not gonna look at this. I'm not gonna think to look at this. So call me stupid in the comments if you want. That's fine. I'm a big boy. I can take it. But absolutely not my first thought when trying to figure out. How this whole thing was supposed to work. Absolutely was not my first thought. Alright. How close are they? Yep, they still need the metal fasteners because they don't have any coal. But at least this is making more coal. Right? Right? Can I can I just mine only coal? I can. There we go. That's what we're doing for right now. We're gonna mine only coal. And then one of these is going to be only iron ore. Or only coal. Yep. And this has to go down one more level. And then I think I think that's everything we're going to have to do for this. So this guy is going to go down here. Yep. Exactly what we're up to. Please finish this before this video is an hour long or people are going to be upset with me. Um, I will... Oh, those are already those are already set in place. That's fine. Yep, still waiting on metal fasteners, but at least I have one gravity battery. Woo! We did it. We have a gravity battery. So that's got to go... I guess I could just have this go all the way around like this. There's no reason not to. Uh, this is going to get moved, this salt storage. But we'll get that all uh, We'll get that all figured out. All right. Stairs. Mine. Come on. Place it. Now hopefully nobody else gets stuck in here. 
But now we have we have a mine here, we have a mine here. Once it's actually finished. That recipe, this one's currently doing coal. This one, I guess, can do iron. We'll just uh, have that going on forever. We have a bunch of iron ore stored up here, so uh, that's fine. Um, how are they getting on on our giant buried tank? They have everything except the metal blocks, the gears, and the giant blueprint. So I'm going to... Now, do I have any space to put giant buried tank blueprints? That's not going to go in a pile. Medium cauldron's already been used for the kitchen house, cooking house. Is cooking house and kitchen house a different building? No, mechanized kitchen house, but this is just a normal cooking house. But then you have a greater cooking house. My, my, my grasp of the English language is not good enough to understand this, apparently. Um, I need to... No, not a warehouse. Where am I supposed to... Can I can I build a storage for a scroll rack outside of a library? Nope. It needs to be built in the library. So do I have to build another library? Please do not make me build another library. To have this in a separate thing. I saw... Jeez. Oh, if I have to build another library to build this in a second district, I'm going to lose my freaking mind. Um, No, because I did this. I put these primitive dams in. Which needed a, um, which needed something. All right. Am I going to just have to manually enable, um, blueprints? Which, oh God, which one? I need names. I, I can't do this with pictures. Um, that's a large water wheel. That's ENS. Giant buried tank fancy blueprints. There we go. Always import. So that might uh that might let them get one of those in there. Maybe. We'll see what happens. I know we have tons of them stored in the library here. So we shall see. What are we waiting on here? Metal fa hey, guess what? The metal fasteners we can't make because we don't have the coal that we're trying to make from the mine that we're trying to make with the metal fasteners. Yeah. Mmm. Love it. Yep, still, uh, still waiting. Still trying to figure out how this is, uh, uh, how this is working here. At some point, they should, you know, take those blueprints over there. One would think. But, good news! We have gravity batteries. The bad news is... Still producing more power than we need, so we're not going to get to see these work. But, the other news is... We can blow this up down here and see just how uh, how much more power we get. Just make a little slot for them to slide into. Just like that with that exact sound. Um, now the question, question is, can I, can I, can I cheese this? Oh, okay, no, he's smart. He's smart. <laughs> not not going to let me do that. All right. Well, it was, it was worth a shot. We have gravity batteries. We have uh, some amount of sunflower oil, and we have uh, we have water here. But at what cost? I, I really I cannot keep calling videos. We have X Y Z, but at what cost? Because I, I think people are going to get irritated with me if I keep doing that. But I mean it 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 really it really does apply. It really does apply to what all this stuff that just seems to always happen to me. <laughs> I play this game. Okay, we have we have the blueprint. That means I can turn this off now. But man, alive! What a uh, what a struggle of a journey in today's episode. Oh, we got we got to wait for metal blocks, gears, and I guess tar metal fasteners. So that's not going to be done today. But we have gravity batteries, and we've got spicy sodas, and we've got all this other fun stuff. And now I just need to make more storage for everything. But yeah, I hope you uh, hope you enjoyed my suffering today. This was a rough, this was a really rough one. But that's uh, that's the way things go. And uh, there's not too much else you can do about that. Just got to get some stuff figured out. We'll, of course, be back with this series on Saturday, picking up with the next installment of that. So if you have any comments, questions, concerns, want to roast me for being bad at the game, please uh, do so kindly in the comments. 
And uh, I look forward to reading those and responding uh, when I have something to respond to in that regard. Other than that, I'm just very thankful that you're here as well as thankful for the Beard Boosters making these videos possible with all of their generous support. So uh, thanks to those folks. You can see their names on the screen. But it is well and truly time now for this video to be over <laughs> and for us to uh, come back and check on this in a later date. But hey, we got water here, finally. Half a cycle too late, but we got it. And we got some spicy soda, so now we uh, now we can just kind of conveniently uh, forget that we murdered 20-some beavers for the uh, ability to build a windmill so we can make some... Uh, <laughs> Uh, so we can make some sunflower oil, so we can make some explosives to put a mine in. Oh, what a mess. But yeah, I digress. That's it. Have a great rest of your day, uh, whatever, it is you do, whatever it is you're doing. Have fun, stay safe, and we'll see you tomorrow for some Update 5 fun. But yep, see you later. Bye-bye.